What's up guys, Goro here and welcome to the first 6pm content video of the year for FC25. It is also our first FC25 video of the year, so there is a lot to get into. We're going to dive into today's content for the release of Web App. There is quite a bit to get involved in, so we are going to go through everything for you guys. If you are new to the channel, don't forget to leave the video a like, rating, comment, subscribe, all that good stuff. And with that being said, let's get into this 6pm content. And so, here we go go it is content time it is hopefully going to be good for us now obviously this is not quite in game as what we'd like it is going to take another day or two for us to get into the game but still for now we will make do with what we have so for content today it is wednesday which means there is a brand new team of the week and we already have our first special messi he is finally getting an upgrade after about 10 minutes i know it's kind of crazy but not only do we have messi we have benzema uzman dembele we also have um rodman in there as well who a lot of people liked at the start of last season and um, zachariah is in there as well as cross gavelia we've also got brill in there with lauren gabriel is obviously in there from the north london derby plus we have teo hernandez and then in goal we have ruley plus this year we have a bench and a reserves so instead of it just being the 18 it's gone back to 23 which i love adiemi who we obviously knew was going to get one thanks to his performance at the weekend has got a team of the week and uh, we also have tukan who oh, sorry not tukan uh, trinkau who has good links to the swedish striker from lisbon as well so that will be something a lot of people will like ricky Puig is in there as well again Good for objectives going forward because we know Spain and the MLS are going to be heavily featured this season, which is great. Hudson Adoy in there as well. Sadly, uh, for me, as you can probably tell by the backdrop behind me as a Liverpool fan, not ideal. Although Boniface is coming in as well as having Lamine Yamal at 84 rated already, already with a special card. Things you love to see. And then Prabo as well, or Prado, however you pronounce his name. I don't quite know. Uh, we've also got, obviously, the discard informed in here as well. But Chambers is a bronze card. And so I think also some of these, I think these two are silver cards as well. And so because these are silver cards and bronze cards, you can get them in those respective packs. Which means if you can get one in a sort of 750 bronze pack and you can quick sell it for 10k coins, it's fantastic. Um, but yeah, so not so many amazing cards in terms of the reserves but a good way to make 10,000 coins straight away into your club. Obviously, like me, you might have 1,000 coins and that's about it. So any coins are very much handy. Now, going into SBCs, carrying on with the Team of the Week, there is a Team of the Week Cosmetic Evo. It is two 84-rated teams for it. They do yield back a small Electrum Players pack, which is tradable, so it's some coins back if you're getting a lot of untradable cards. However... I don't really think this is worth it right at the start. And um, complete these challenges to elevate your team of the week players uh, with an elite embellishment and shimmering animation. It quite literally is just an animation. That is it. So it's great if you pack maybe a Messi and you want him to look extra special. I fully get it. But is it worth it? Not really, in all honesty. I don't think it is whatsoever. We also have for the club challenge. This one's a little bit more complicated and there's a specific thing you need to do with this personally because it's an untradable small electron players pack as your reward only use untradable cards and the reason i say that is because you want to make the most of your coins at the start of the game it's not worth doing it in terms of what you need obviously you can't see this behind me but uh, if i drop this down here you need three squads uh, sorry three leagues in your squad and um, you need players from the same league maximum five players from the same club minimum two so you are going to have to find two players from the same club not the easiest things to do right at the start of the game especially with untradeables you only need 10 chemistry that is going to be super easy to do you need nine players in the team which again not the full 11 which is something decent but 70 rated so with a few bronzes you're going to need a few golds Although with starter packs, you do get a few untradeable gold cards in the club, which is great. Now, not only do we have that, we obviously have all of our foundations as we always expect at the start of the game. Plus, hybrid league nations and league and nation hybrids. Now, because these all give out untradeable packs, what I would suggest is possibly looking at doing the sort of hybrid leagues and nations first. And then with those gold cards, if you can't do any more in terms of them, go ahead and complete for the club challenge just with obviously the bits and bobs you've got left behind all the cards that are from 
non-major leagues from non-major nations they are ideal to just throw into this and get your chemistry with bronze cards that you're getting from obviously foundations that is the best way that i could describe doing it for you the bronze and silver packs and the gold upgrades are all there for you they have always been there at the start of every game are they worth it personally no not right now unless you are doing bpm now that is something that we can go into in a bit but that is pretty much it for content now what you guys will also be getting at 6 p.m or when you're logging onto the web app at least is all your welcome back packs i've already opened mine they are going to be in probably tomorrow's video of a brand new series coming to the channel and um, but for the time being that is it for content on this game right now obviously we are just over i'm looking at this on my screen right now one day five hours and 32 minutes away from early access which i cannot wait for and if you are on xbox you might be flying to new zealand for that to be 12 hours earlier but let me know down below what you guys are packing from your um from your rewards from all of the packs that you get the welcome back packs and for now that's where we're gonna leave it for today i'm out peace